character, and we're making our game at a snail's pace, but I don't care because it's fun. Screw you. All right, let's continue onward. Last time we were making a big old room for Ralph Project here so he can teach some computer adoras. All right, let's continue onward then. All right, music. There we go. I forget which one it was. Coding. Okay, found it. Had to control F. This really should be a conditional thing. Nobody else would care about this. Okay. Please tell me I, did, I remember to put that. Okay, good. Right. Oh, hello. What's all this? Huh. I see. You know what else I wanted to make sure I do? I actually want to use a plugin. Let me come back to this. Because I want my text to be fancier and I want it to have the, the character names above it. I can't quite remember which one that would be though. Uh, let's see. Message core event. It's more features to the message window to customize the way your messages appear in functions. Okay, sure. Uh, okay. Let's turn this one on and see what we got. There you go, well, it's true. <laughs> this game should be called Meta. Let's do it. We're creating the Meta here, sons and daughters. So, okay. What did I just do for myself now with that plugin? Let's find out. Doggo? Doggo! I guess I should find out how this works. Let me... That's not what I wanted. Watching Oblivion LPs in class, there you go. Okay, which is the one on the freaking, uh, let's see, message core? Message core, here we go.
I want the one where it's got the names above. Okay, that's not there yet. That's still not there. Here we go. Okay. Name box window. This is what I'm looking for. The name box window displays a name in a separate window outside of the main message window. You prick. No, okay, I'm kidding. I don't know what I'm doing. Help. Ah, here we go. Alright, all we have to do is write this text code somewhere in the message. Really now. Somewhere in the message, huh? Okay, it won't show in here. What? Hmm. Whoa. X will appear in the name. Let's find out if this really works the way I perceive it to. Oh wow, dang, that's nice. Okay. Cool. Alright, I'm not gonna call him Blaine Phoenix each time though. Oh heck yeah, last night out too, I love this song. I'm gonna shut up so you can listen to it. Let's see if it's being legit here by meaning everywhere or anywhere. Yeah, it means anywhere. Cool. Handy feature. Well, let's add it all to everyone now. Using them plugins, son. Copy pasting this at this point, jeez. <laughs> Can you feel the chill? Oh, yeah. Can you feel the chill in the air? Can you feel the chill? Quest for every monitor to say something different. So start yelling out ideas in chat as to what you would like some of these monitors to say. Oh, Route Project had one. Undertale. I still have to think about that. Oh, wait. Oh. I didn't catch Larmentations. Here we go. Okay. Oh, crud, Twitch chat, no! Okay. Wait, I can do colors and stuff, too. Let's find out how to do colors. Oh, that's cool. 
in the colored text. Let's see if I can find it. Oh wait, hold on. There's a text file somewhere. Ah! Well, let's just look at that then. Okay. Oh, I can't control F, dang. CX. Oh, I don't know the color numbers though. Guess we'll have to find out. Kaiba? Crap, I already forget what it was. <laughs> Just color X, right? OCX, okay. How do you close it out, though? Let me see. Wait, that's just the outline. Hold on, I'm not getting anything I want here. Hold on. Am I? Well, let me just find the blasted example in the video. I'm gonna mess around with things here. Alright, let me write all these ideas out first. Zarathos, what's up? One episode, one piece episode marathon, jeez. Which ones have I skipped? I think just these two. Hey Fabian, we're putting things on these monitors. Come up with something hilarious and we'll put it on this monitor.
I think this one's off. Yeah, this one's off. Fantastic. Okay. this joke? I forget how this joke goes. Let me look this up. There's like a, there's, there's a freaking coding joke or something that you, you replace someone's semicolon with a symbol that looks exactly like the semicolon. Greek question mark. That's what it is. Okay. There we go. Glorious. We got a bunch of references and stuff in this room.
What was this one? I think that was it. Zello's typo here. Sure did. Well, these are in fact the base. Oh, well, these are the, the sci fi tiles, actually, now that I'm thinking about it. I do believe they came with every game, though, regardless of whether you pre ordered. I could be wrong. Out. He knows. He knows. It's evil. Oh god, that looks horrible. Okay, I'm not sure what that did. Let's find out. Oops, I closed my music by mistake. There we go. Okay. So... You know, I just need to look at the freaking video. It's a good website to find scripts and tiles that says there isn't a Steam Workshop yet. I completely... let's see... Hmm... Where would it in fact be? I don't know. I'm sure there's some website. Uh, I'm sure the forum on the actual RPG Maker site, they've got to have something going on already. Wait a minute. Ah, here we go. This is what I'm looking for. You know what values? Okay. Oh wait, I'm supposed to be doing this instead. Aha. Okay. Hey, it is. It's fantastic. There we go. Okay. Except the spacing is awkward, so I see I don't want to space here. So it's very similar to ZC syntax. Great, we got it. Okay, let's see, we've got Inazuma the Lightning. Inazuma the Lightning. If that's a Ninja Gaiden reference, perhaps. Welcome to Strem. Captain Blue! So let's see, this is dependent on my system, huh? Oh wait, how do I see that again? Oh, the file. Where the file for the project system folder. Um. Well, what we're doing is we're making a game with suggestions from our studio audience here today. And we'll be doing this until we're, like, done. So this will take, like, a thousand years, but hey, we're doing something. Why am I not... Why am I not seeing this? What is the storyline for this game? Boy, isn't that the $640,000 question. This is going to be random jank the game so far. Uh, maybe we'll work a serious plot into it at some point, and possibly having to do with some kind of artifact. If I can find this blasted folder. Why am I not finding this folder? Let's keep looking. Ah. Okay, so this is the color set that I'm using. Okay, great. Uh, which I do believe is very similar to the default one I just saw here. We gotta follow. Who is that? Ah, uh, we've got... Kiri... Okay. Hirigeya Kazuto the Battle has followed. Thank you very much for the follow, good sir. 
All right. Oops, I shut off my music by mistake. Okay. Yeah, I do believe this is the same setup. It should be. Okay. There we go. All right. Yeah, so why isn't the follow thing showing up on the screen? I must have to do something different with this box that I'm not doing. Hmm. I really gotta figure out what that is and how it works. Because I've definitely not got the intended way that it's supposed to work. Okay. So we gotta get all our random jokes out of the way. Now we actually have to get to like a serious part of the game. So let's see, after you're done explorating a bit, we also have to add some more stuff out here. You've been here for about five minutes and we've given you ideas for a game. Well, that's fantastic. I like to hear that because inspiration is really kind of a funny thing. It can just get you and then you're like, you're hooked. So, very glad to hear that. But yep, our character is a professor who studies darkness. And, uh, he's gonna have a bunch of stuff happen, so let's get to some stuff that's gonna happen now. Where are I thought I saw some tr indoor trees earlier. Oh, yeah, here we go. We gotta decorate this place a bit more. It's a little blank right now. Not much going on. Yeah, see, shoot, I'm kind of regretting the size of this hallway now. Ah, well, it's not that big, but, uh... I should probably put some, like, study tables out here or something. Fountains! Good idea, Jubze. Where we got some fountains? Ah, oh, couches! Here we go. We can have, like, students hanging out and stuff. How big are we planning on making the school? Uh, the school will probably be bigger in, like, description than it'll actually be on screen. So we're not going to make it too big. I'm probably just going to have this main area for a few classrooms with, like, random cameos or maybe some mini games or something later on. Then we'll have, like, the offices upstairs or whatever. So, in fact, here, let's make a staircase going upstairs to the offices. All right, I want to center this, though. Center it here. Okay. There we go. That actually looks a bit strange. Let's. Ah. ah, I gotta get rid of these shadows. Yeah, I guess that works. I don't know. I can probably do that in some better way. Alright, we didn't make our tractor joke yet. We have to make a classroom with the tractor joke. So let's see, how far down is this? This is one, two, three, four down, so this should be one, two, three, four up. Okay. Does that really align? Hmm, I guess it does. No, I don't think it does at all. Let's, let's put it up further. What were you on? You're on, uh, three. Okay. There we go. That's not lined up. Nine. Eight. There we go. Now it's lined up. Okay, some stuff for students to do. Where's that fountain? Maybe we'll do like a lobby area somewhere else with a fountain. I don't seem to... F I can't seem to find one though. Hmm. Oh, I can put experimental stuff out here. That's cool. That's what you see in a college, right? <gasps> I'm interested to see what kind of new resources we might run into soon, though. I'm sure someone's already, like, been building tiles and whatever. 
usually when new engines like this get announced, someone is immediately like on top of it. Just they know what they want to do with it. It's really incredible. How they just like hear of the engine coming out and they're like, yeah, I want to do that. <laughs> this one's pretty chill. Yeah, we're gonna have to make a dorm building. Actually, is there a... How's the outside tile look for this sci-fi stuff? Hmm. Not too bad. Got casinos. That's good. Love me some casinos. Well, we got cars as well. Whoops. <laughs> Almost changed the walkability. Oh, here's some fountains. Wait a minute. You know what? I'm being silly. I can add more. Jubsy, you're gonna get your fountain one way or the other. If T. Mudif has something to say about it. We just extended the tile set. Let's see how this looks. Great! We got you covered, Jubsy. Does it make an animation? Let's find out. Doesn't seem to. Ah, that's a shame, but oh god. I've done something hor- Oh, I didn't set the freaking- Dang it. That's right. I have to do all that myself. Okay. Uh, so let's see. Um, this can be... So it should be maybe let them walk behind that. I don't know. I mean, I don't know. I'll test it out. Definitely these things. This might take a while. I can probably do this later on. Ooh, is that blood? Oh, jeez. Oh boy, we got the blood in the Team Udif game. So what I'm doing here is I'm just setting the solidity. If it's a star, that means I kind of walk behind it as though it's a layer above me. If it's an X, cannot pass through it. You can also do selective directions as far as passing and stuff. This song always reminded me of Donkey Kong. Give it a listen. It's called The Sunset. Oh wait, it's gotta be walkable. Okay. Sadly, this takes a while, but uh, it's not bad usually. I mean, you're really just clicking a bunch of stuff. It's not like they're asking anything too in depth of you. Let's see. I'm not too sure what those are, so I'm going to leave them alone for now. Tanks! Ooh. How exciting. Is that an Eiffel Tower? Huh. Kind of. I believe that's it. Alright, we'll do more later if we have to. There's a Kraken hidden inside the fountain. First bonus boss. I've, I'm certain we've got a Kraken in the default tiles. Let's find out. Zombies, wind wisps. Let's see. Oh wow, those snakes look pretty twisted. You can also change the hue. Like if you want uh, different palette enemies. Like you know how in the old school RPGs you run into similar looking enemies multiple times, but uh, if they're a different color, that suddenly means that like one's stronger than the other. Ta oh god, that's creepy. Wow. Toxic drugs. Mage? That mage looks pretty cool. Mamiya. Huh. Oh my god, this thing's... Iron Giant. Alright. General... Alright, Gazer... Oh wow, that's... That's interesting. That looks like a Zelda enemy or something, with all the eyes it's got. It's pretty cool. Evil God. Well, that, uh... If there ever was to be an evil god, I bet it would look like that. Death. Wonderful. It's an interesting take on death, come to think of it. 
Dark Lord Final. Dark Lord. Dark Lord Final. Dark Lord. Chimera. Chimeramon! You came back to me. And then you, like, failed. Because the freaking Digidestined always won. Except against Black War Greymon. He actually kind of whipped their backsides quite a few times, as I recall. Alright, well, there's no Kraken, but uh, I'm sure we can find one. Yeah, palette swapped versions of bosses. There you go. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles did that as well. They had, like, palette swaps of enemies you already fought. Creepy bear. Creepy bear sitting on the table. Blaine faces. I like Blaine faces. Let's look at the Blaine faces that Kate has made for us. I shut off my thing, by the way, for those of you who are kind of new here. Uh, just so I don't show off things like on Skype and whatever. There we go. We're back already. Okay. Let's see what some Blaine faces are. Oh, Kate made us a variety pack of Blaine faces. That's cool. Wait, what the heck? Is that something on my monitor? Or is that the... Uh, okay. Looked like he was blushing, but that's something on my monitor. Yeah. He's like, what the flid? Yeah, okay, I get it. Huh, that's a funny joke. I would be laughing if I hadn't told it myself. Ugh, I don't know about this. And uh, Really? Are you freaking kidding me? Yeah, that sounds about right. Good, good. We got a fantastic variety pack of faces here. Thank you, Kate. It's not showing up. Oh, I picked the wrong window. <laughs> Dang it. Okay, let me start again. Angry Blaine. Confused Blaine. What's going on here? Eh. Haha, -ha, lol. I don't know about this. And, ugh, you freaking people. You freaking... <laughs> okay, anyway, we're good. We're okay. We got it. We got this. We're under control. You're out of control, John. You're out of control. Nobody here is even named John. Actually, is anyone here actually named John? I think we could have some Johns. Some Johnnies, as Jubsy would call them. You're out of control, John. Have some pipes building or something. I don't know. Just to decorate it a tad more. Why not? Your name is John. We got a John. We've won the game. No jobs. <laughs> Get out, Jackie. <laughs> Talking to the guy who replaced you. Yeah, okay, sure. Why not? Oh, he picked a room number, like, ages ago. This is G914. I, I completely forgot. Okay, good for me. At least I remembered the number. <laughs> I love this one. That is a good face, Kate. Well, well done. Good drawings. Yeah, we've used them right away. But the real question is, tonight, are we going to British? I don't know. Actually, you know what? Let me compress this just a tad. I don't actually need all this. Oh, wait. How is this? Wait, how am I doing this? I think what I want to do here. Oh, God, so many things. I don't remember. Okay. 
Nope, that's the wrong one. I think what I want here is to just drop this one and call this one Blaine 1. Which should still work. Okay. Except there was one that I used the old one on. Okay. Yeah, here we go. Yeah. Great. <laughs> We've got two things about Revere. Rev oh, uh, Reverbius. Okay. See, you look at some of these names and you're just like, how the flid would I even like pronounce this? And then you like you just start to say it and you generally get the gist of it. Okay. Um. What other one did I use that I think I have to replace now? Was it this one? No. Ah, I don't remember. We'll have to ask Scott Steiner in order to find out what the verb Britishing means, I'm sure. Okay. Uh, okay. You're the most Canadian person here right now. Is Shimo in here? Shimo's hiding somewhere? He's got some, uh, no? Okay. Good audience. All right, just to see if this freaking thing has broken again. Where is it? Okay. This thing didn't break again, did it? No, it didn't. Okay, we're good. Just had to make sure. Okay. All right. What else do we want? Oh, we need students, dude. We need students for this here school. What is this thing? It's like a... Looks like almost an old school phone or something. How long has this episode been going? Oh, we've got some time left. Great. You know, and you look at something that seems a little off and it makes you uneasy, that's how you feel. Someone makes a T the wrong way. That's how to British. I see! Well then. Alright. Population time. We need some characters. Here's some characters. Oh, I didn't have Kate do the faces. That's okay. Ah, dang it, I should give her the faces. Hold on. Let me give her the faces. Really quick. Oh, wait. Uh, I gotta kill the window first. There we go. I promise this will be the only instant of the faces you'll have to do, Kate, because we, we found that, like, slightly better way to do it, question mark. Okay. So this is just the thing where we're making them in like the four by twos. All right, I should really drop that though. Okay, I don't know. We'll have to like maybe just make new random characters or something. All right, let me kill this window because it's just confusing me. And there we go. Okay. Glorious. All right. Hi, Professor Phoenix. Oh. All right. Let's have some people running around. Oh, we should have some guys playing cards or something, like right outside the bathroom. No, let's not. Let's make like a new table here or something. Okay. I, th I s there's got to be cards or something. What is this? Those are papers. Those are not cards. Where is, let's see, does the casino have any cards somewhere here? I'm sure it would if they existed. Oh, blast, I don't see any cards. A fire extinguisher randomly sitting in the lobby? They got two fire extinguishers randomly sitting in the library. Oh, okay, I guess. What's the name of our card game, everyone? We need a card game in this jank and we're gonna name it something. Got a laptop playing the Guild of Dungeoneering. Oh no, I'm dropping frames. Stop dropping those frames. There we go, that's right. You stop it. Oh no, it's dropping more. 
Stop it. Stop dropping. Yep. Yep. It's going from green to orange. Okay, I think it's stabilized. All right. Gathering the magic. That's almost a pun based on what's what the thing is going to be in the story, so I don't know. Dungeon dice monsters get out, jobs. <laughs> All right. Do I need... I don't need this anymore. Well, I guess it's my intro thing. Okay, I'll just leave it there for now. A card game where every move is decided by a dice roll. Isn't that just dungeon, Dungeons and Dragons, like, in a nutshell? Like everything is determined by a dice roll? Okay, so in any case, we need, uh, we need some of our new BA characters here. Yugimon the Gathering. That might be a little too closely referenced to get away with it. You get... <laughs> oh, I remember that joke from ages ago. Gathering the chopper is not bad. Chop of the gathering. Hmm. Uh, direction fix. Card game where every card is an ace of spades and the loser is the person holding an ace of spades. Well, that is, that sure is something. Let's see if I have any card icons buried in like some old files here and we can just import them or my mouse will disconnect. That's, that's a good job there, mouse. All right. We're looking for cards, everyone. Let's see. Well, here's a deck of cards. May May is the card game. May May is the Gathering. Let's see. Oh, that's kind of close to what I'm looking for. We need a girl who goes Blaine Senpai. Yeah, okay. Uh, where are those cards? They're somewhere here, so I don't have to scroll. Oh, here's like a, a pile of money or something. Jeez. Okay. What the flit is this thing? Look at this thing over here. What is it? Is vastly confusing to me because it's new. Here's the cards. I lost them. Here they are. It's a bit off center, I think. Let me see the freaking. Okay. Two away, two, is that May 24? No. Are you kidding me? It's just like, it's off center no matter what. Okay. Copper. All right. Boss key from Link to the Past. Where is this hiding? This is something I want to see because it's a Link to the Past. Ah, there it is. Fantastic. It actually is here. Ooh, there's presents too. Man, I just have to like... Okay. To figure out how I'm doing this. I want these icons. I want them now. Oh, here's a deck of cards. Dude, there's decks of cards all over the place up here. What the flit am I looking at? Okay. All right, and they're supposed to be... What did we determine they are? They're 48 by 48, were they? They're 32 by 32. I think they might not be. They have to be. How else would they fit this? They're like 34 by 34? What the mold? No, that's not right. Oh, 
Okay, I'm coming over here because I obviously can't tell where an icon starts and where an icon ends. Here. Okay. Yeah, those are definitely 32 by 32. Okay. So I'm turning a 24 by 24 into a 32 by 32. Let's see how much we can screw this up. I gotta center this now is the only thing. Oh, I can't center it, that's right. We can center it to the best of our ability there. Okay, there's a tile. Oh no, but the transparency. Okay, well, we'll try our paint.net thing or whatever that someone suggested earlier. Okay. Give me more drugs. It actually almost looks like a Yu-Gi-Oh deck. This one right here. God, they're, they're all one tile off. Like how the flid, how was this made? Double of 64, unfortunately, okay. I have to be able to like, ah, here we go. Okay, so it has to start here. Okay, so now it's starting at three, three. So this is where it starts. It's one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, five, six. <sighs> this I don't know. This is kind of janky. <laughs> Jeez, Chopper, wow. You really uh you really kicked it into high gear there, buddy. <laughs> this thing is so weird, look at it. What the flit is this supposed to be? It's like if Kirby was a bomb and realized he was about to explode and then was like, dang, I shouldn't have eaten that bomb. There's a tiara. Let's grab another deck or something. Let's grab something else. I'll grab a present. This tile set's going to include a present. How exciting. This is the best thing ever. Okay, so you must start at 65. Timer smashing the card game. Blaine Phoenix confirmed for world champion. 65, where are you? Where are you, 65? It's not showing me 65 for some reason. Why is it stopping? Okay, here's 65. Whatever the flit is doing, here's 65. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Good enough. We've got it. Let's see. Oh, I need another folder. You know what? Okay. I know what I'm going to do. Let me grab something off Skype really fast. Hearthstone the Gathering. Where the heck is everything, dude? There we go. Okay, wait, what, am I, what exactly am I doing? Okay, hold on. Just, I'm just going to call this random items for now. I need just somewhere to store this. 
Okay. All right, what do we have here? Four hearts of damage, the card game, Super Bomber Kirby, deck building the game, War of Worldcraft. Let's see, parallel decks. That's that's uh, that's probably our winner. Eh. Parallel axe is good enough. Doesn't need the whole thing. What do we got? A couple minutes left. Alright. Just call the game Epi. Epi. Call the game Epi. Okay, so now what I'm looking to do is this has to go in wherever the heck all these things are, which I believe is the characters folder. This is the wrong one. Characters. See if this shows up the way I intend it to get some items. Dang it. Oh, the sheet has to be a certain size. It should be the same size as... Okay, all right. Wait, is that too big? That might be too big. Yeah, we'll try. What? What? Why are you saving it again? Oh, because I, I changed the directory. That's why. Okay, sure. We lost our music as well. Ah! Oh. <laughs> I did something wrong. Okay. Hmm. God dang it. I set it up for icons, not for... Okay, well, screw it. We tried. <laughs> I give up. I'll just wait for more resources or something. So I need something better to put there in the meantime. What is this? Can I perceive that as a card deck? I, maybe I can. I don't know. They will, for now. Here's some random stuff. Someone left their food. Uh, no, Fabian, I was trying to get my new icons in here, but I, I made them the wrong size. I have to make them 48 by 48 instead of 36 by 36. So, screw it, I'm done. Or wait, what did I do here? I made them 24 by 24? I don't remember what I did at all. Wait a minute. That's just doubling it. Hold on. How do I double this, though? I know there's a way to double it somehow. Resize by percentage. Double. Do it. Do they look any crappier? Let's find out. I'm about to find out, Kaiba. Son of a flid. <laughs> what is it doing? What size does it want? It doesn't want any of these sizes. I don't know what size this is that it wants. They're all different depending on the sheet. Like, look at this one. This one's pulling from a different size entirely. Huh. 
The icons were 24 by 24, but I don't know what the... 32. Let's try 32. Uh, wrong folder. Right folder. This isn't going to work now because I it won't go backwards, I bet. Okay. So, what I need then is... Uh, let's see. I'm going from... Oh, that's not a... That's not a fast one, is it? Let's see. Dang, that's a freaking... Mm, I can't round it. It's this one and one third. I can't do that here. Because I can't tell this one third. Oh, wait. Hmm. Maybe I could figure out what I want. Okay. What do I have here? I've got something that's, what, 72 by... Oh, what did I do here? What did I do with this? It looks like I, uh... I don't know what I did with these things. Who was paying attention to what I did? What did I do to these things? Ah, screw it. <laughs> Next time, we continue on and populate.